Well, guys, it looks like a really nice night in New Orleans. Uh, this is a, a live webcam, Bourbon Street. And I want to thank my subscriber for sending it along to me. Yeah, it does. It looks a little wet, like maybe they had some rain, but hey, it doesn't look like a hurricane is sitting right off the coast. doesn't look like... Um, anybody is sheltering in place and you're supposed to be sheltering in place by 8 p.m. and it's 10 p.m. maybe they're all going home now isn't it 8 o'clock in New Orleans if it's 10 o'clock in South Carolina well okay doesn't look like anybody's all that worried this is so bizarre kind of surreal yeah it feels a little surreal alright well um, okay I what do you say well here um, health and human services declares public health emergency in Louisiana the Department of Health and Human Services has declared a public health emergency in Louisiana in, pre in preparation for the impact from Tropical Storm Barry. Uh, they've also staged around 100 public health officials along with supplies in the region. We are fully prepared to support communities that need our help due to the storm. We are working closely with state health and emergency management officials to anticipate the community's health care needs and be ready to meet them. Okay. Um, all right. Do these people know that they will have health care needs tomorrow and that the Department of Health and Human Services is there with their 100 officials to service them what are we living what the hell are we living well this is the storm this is Barry a long line of generated thunderstorms, the train, the training. Yes, they call it training now. Sorry, but this is not a Trump storm. Look at this. Well, it looks like whatever rain is coming into Louisiana is just missing New Orleans, that's why you got a lot of people walking around Bourbon Street. Oh, uh, well, I don't know what to say anymore about this world that we are living in. I don't know. But it sure does look like they're going to bring something to you. Uh, this looks like it's like lava from a volcano that's erupting. The superheating is sure going on still. It's been going on for quite a while. You can see the microwaves within the superheating these ripples down here. Well, uh, this is this is what's happening as people just stroll on by having a good old time you've got 100 officials in Louisiana for a public health emergency you've got your regional transit authority suspending services at 9 p.m. 8 p.m. local time uh, because there's been an order to shelter in place which also starts at the same time. So, 8 p.m. local time. Uh, 
you guys are going to be arrested because you're not sheltering in place. Maybe you're going home now. It looks like, yeah, the, the, I think the shelter in place is actually taking place because it looks like, well, this establishment is closed because it, Bourbon Street, this area of New Orleans, they have their doors open, they have a lot of people on the streets. And these doors are open. But earlier I saw people sitting out on the table. So uh, um, at the tables, it does look like they're closing down for for this. So yeah, 8 p.m. transit services suspended. Louisiana Senator, we are as ready as we can be for Barry. Look, I'm not saying nothing really bad is going to happen. What I am saying is whatever does happen, it ain't no hurricane, it ain't no tropical storm, and it is manufactured by man to create a lot of destruction. Every storm is different, but they have two things in common. This is from your senator, Senator Kennedy. They make you realize that the power of nature can humble the power of human beings anytime it wants to. And the other thing I always learn is if you are not scared, you are either a fool or a liar. Hmm. Well, uh, that's quite a judgment that you're making, Senator Kennedy. And there are a lot of people who just don't have fear like you do, apparently. So, um, to realize the power of nature. You think this guy doesn't know about weather modification? I don't, considering there have been congressional hearings on weather modification, legislation introduced and, and passed on weather modification. So, they're all lying sacks of shit. Uh, fool or a liar. Uh, I'll call you a liar. So, Barry is expected to make landfall, landfall as a hurricane on Saturday. On Saturday. Red Cross shelters are open. Call 211 if you need a safe place to go. U.S. Coast Guard is on it. Oil and gas producers in the Gulf of Mexico evacuate. Platforms, rigs, 257 production platforms, which is 38% of the 669 manned platforms in the Gulf. Wow. Yeah, corporations have nothing to do with all of the destruction of Earth. It's only the soccer mom driving that SUV and the cows farting and, well, the two-legged breathing. Ten rigs, which is 47% of the 21 rigs in the same area. Another 11 rigs have been moved off location. Utility companies make last-minute preparations. All right, well, um, I will, I will link below, but these people walk them with their suitcases, and then you have, you know, this guy has been standing outside on this corner for hours. I want to know what that is. I want to know his, what is his pamphlet? Guys, I don't know what to tell you. Um, this is, this is really very weird. All right, so I just hope they don't bring, like, a weather bomb to all of you tomorrow morning. I hope that you all stay safe, as safe as everybody is walking down Bourbon Street. 
man. All links are below, including the link to this live webcam.